Hey everyone, welcome to my Craftly Cook. Today I will show you my most favorite and the fun part of this project that is coloring this fully dried paper welcome sign which I have left for drying overnight and now it has become very strong and sturdy. If you have seen my previous video then you must remember that we have painted this whole project this whole sign with glue and water mixture uh, which is the reason it has become so hard and now it's time for coloring and uh, if you are new to my channel and this is your first video then I request you to check the description box below for the link of my previous video where I have shared the whole process of making this welcome sign. Now let's start painting. Uh, here I am using acrylic colors only. And um, in my last video I have mentioned that uh, I wish this sign to have more like rustic or antique look. So for that reason um, I am using here this black acrylic paint. Uh, to color the uh, color the whole project if you have acrylic spray paint then you can use it uh, it can save a lot of your time uh, the base is going to be dark and then we will um, work on layers of color from darker then to the more lighter and brighter colors acrylic acrylic colors you know dries out really quickly uh, so here I am dipping my brush in water also time to time to activate the color and spread the color more. Here the first layer of color is has dried out completely uh, now I have used uh, another layer layer of green color here I'm going to use I have used um, first dark green color and then uh, more brighter lighter green color here I am um, uh, I am cleaning my uh, brush in a paper uh, in the side to get rid of the excess color and then painting with uh, very light strokes because I just need only the uh, texture to get colored. I don't need to uh, color it completely all the way. adding a little bit of orange along with the uh, green acrylic paint uh, to give it a more brownish green color you know uh, the color of the trees or barks that we normally find or you can say you know 
moss color as you can see Here is my dried green color. Uh, I don't have any bronze color with me, uh, so I have uh, used a little bit of uh, acrylic golden powder with uh, red acrylic paint, and it works same as bronze color. And I am using it to. color the flowers and in the next layer uh, i have used silver and gold acrylic paints to highlight the textures more this uh, white pearl acrylic paint to uh, highlight the welcome sign more as you can see uh, it is not visible properly um, because of the uh, all those heavy textures like um, all those rose flowers and uh, on the side branches they are so dark so uh, and welcome written is so thin that's it's not visible properly so uh, i have used this paint to uh, brighten up this welcome written part uh, and also on the sides uh, to make it look more brighter and more visible
our finished project um i'm really happy uh, how it turned out um i hope you also like it uh, i hope you can see all those textures that i am uh, talking about you know um textures from the tissue paper though it's not visible properly uh, i'm going to add some uh, pictures so that you can uh, see it clearly and uh, thank you so much for watching this video if you like it please give a thumbs up and share this video with your friends Uh, and i will also please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and press that bell button so that you can you get notified whenever i uh, post another video so see you soon bye bye